Well, well, well. You've arrived in the universe of Elite Dangerous. You're looking at your shiny new Signwinder. You're thinking of buying a couple of overly camp robots, phoning Renza Wookie, and pulling off a daring plan to rescue a space princess. Well, I've got some terrible news. You, my friend, are a space tramp, and your shiny new Signwinder is an intergalactic equivalent of a shopping trolley with all your possessions. The only daring thing you're going to be pulling off is yourself before you get moved on by the authorities. However, I have some great news. If you follow my guide in 24 hours, you can be rocking in the pimp wagon. That's right, I'm talking about the Anaconda. Before we begin, we're going to have to make a couple of modifications to your shopping trolley. So hop on into the ship outfit and let's get busy. Now, the only thing we're going to do in here is get rid of your fixed pulse lasers and replace them with gimbals. This is going to make things a lot easier in the long run. They're easier to aim and you're less likely to hit the cops. Now, I'm going to be working out of the Jenna hub over in Zaragas, but you can do this from wherever you are in the universe. What we're looking for are high intensity resource extraction sites. Now the best way to find these is to look at the planets and check for major reserves you can see over there on the left. If you find these, go and check them out and they'll turn up on your navigation panel. So we're going to click on down to the high intensity resource extraction site and head on out. Now when you're approaching your resource extraction site, always do it from above or below the planet. You do not want to be travelling through the ring to get there. If you're having problems exiting supercruise and reaching your destination, do yourself a favour and go and check out my video on that subject. Alright then, we've arrived at our destination. Now what you want to do is keep your eyes peeled for Imperial Clippers Federal dropships, pythons and vultures. Now, when you scan these, they'll come up as wanted on the bottom left, and that's what we're after. If you see any other wanted ships, other than the clippers, dropships, pythons and vultures, then you're going to want to save your game, exit and reload until you get a spawn where these guys start appearing. Now, it's taken me about five minutes to generate a big ship spawn. Now, whatever you do, do not engage these guys. You will get absolutely ruined. Instead, what you want to do is grab yourself a newspaper, a pair of scissors, and act all inconspicuous like a 1940s spy. What you're waiting for is for the Federal Security Services to engage the wanted target. And then, much like a pussy in a bar fight, we're going to run on over and stick the boot right in. Now, I'm going to just show you the first two kills in real time so you get an idea of how much money you can earn using this technique. Now, you've got to be a bit careful here. You don't want to do so much damage that that thing turns around and points at you. That would give you a very bad day. So just do enough to register a few hits and then sit back and relax. Hundred and fifteen grand. Bosh. Have a bit of that. Right, as soon as you're done sticking a boot in, flick through your available targets. Keep scanning till you come across another wanted ship. And there we go, we've got a federal dropship ready and waiting. So I'm now going to go in, do exactly the same thing again. I'll speak to you guys in a minute.
get shields offline. And another 97,000 there. That's given us 212,000 credits in just over a couple of minutes. Now, you're going to want to keep this up for another 45 minutes to an hour, depending on how lucky you get with the spawn rate. After a little while, check out your transactions. Once you've got about a million and a half, as we have here, Head on back to your home port. Now, once you get in, hit Starport Services, go over to Contacts, and move over to the right, Redeem All Bounties. Now, try to resist spending your newfound wealth on Ewok porn and alcohol. Take that money, jump on over to my next video, where I'm going to show you how to start making some real money.